Hello everyone, welcome to Lab Medicine. Today we are going to learn about how we determine rheumatoid factor, a protein made by B cells which mistakenly attack our healthy normal cells and tissues. We generally determine this protein in a laboratory by nephelometry method. Here as you can see, we are using Hypro Analyzer for quantitative determination of rheumatoid factor. Firstly, we scan the barcode of the sample. Then we have a sample collector and ammonium chloride buffer in our kit. Required volume of sample is aspirated by capillary, after which we have to insert it into the cuvette containing buffer. Capillary injector contains gamma globulin polystyrene latex particles, which in general is the rheumatoid factor conjugated with immunoglobulin for following the subsequent stage. We then insert the cuvette into the portal, which is then followed by injecting the sample along with latex particles into the buffer. Then it will display time on the screen. One important fact to be considered while performing this test is that due to the impact of evaporation, we have to complete the test immediately once the capillary is full of samples. For this, we have the normal range, zero to 30 international unit per milliliter. In terms of analysis, it is entirely nephelometry with analyzer providing us with the value by measuring the intensity of scattered light. So let's understand with help of simple diagram as shown here. When a ray of incident light coming from a light source having certain wavelength passes through the QV, immune complexes will produce the phenomenon of light scattering which is detected by photomultiplier tube used as a detector. Detector then converts intensity of light into electric signal and ruminotoid factor protein is finally quantified and the results is displayed on screen. So this is how we determine rheumatoid factor in a laboratory. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe and share for more informative videos on lab medicine.